What is up YouTube, it's Hip-Hop Channel YTV and I'm back with another episode. Damian Dash and Karim Big Spark founded legendary Rockefeller Records in 1995 and managed to put out a lot of albums including classics such as Jay-Z's The Blueprint, Kenny West's The College Dropout and many more. But the situation between the three hip-hop artists reportedly ripped the imprint apart and it dissolved in 2013. Eight years later, New York rapper Jay-Z wound up filing a lawsuit against Damon Dash last month for attempting to auction off Jay-Z's debut Reasonable Doubt album as an NFT. Jay-Z ultimately emerged victorious in court and Dash was prohibited from doing anything of the sort, but according to Dash, Jay-Z issues didn't stem from him, instead he blamed the label's downfall on Burke. The reason Rockefeller Records broke up in the first place was cause he didn't want to break bread with Biggs no more, Damon explained during an interesting interview with the Social Proof podcast. But Today I want to show you guys a picture of Jay-Z and Bark. Judging by a recent photograph, however it looks like Jay-Z and Bark's relationship is still strong. You can check out the picture on the screen. On Thursday, a veteran hip-hop artist DJ Clark Kent, who produced three songs on Reasonable Doubt, shared an Instagram photo of himself, Bark and Jay-Z. Also, he captioned the picture, the manager, the MC, the DJ. Always great to see my brothers. While there was no direct reference to Damon Dash's comments, one wonders if the photo was deliberately posted to shut him up. After all, Dash also claimed Jay-Z and Bark were not speaking for like two years and no one knew though. I don't know why they would want to devalue my third, I don't get it. And before I finish the video, I want to ask you guys question of the day. Let me know what you'll think about Dame Dash's allegations against Jay-Z. Write your thoughts in the comments below, stay tuned, subscribe YTV, get the notification bells and don't forget to visit the website hiphoptty.com. Thank you so much for watching, peace.